All right, getting ready to take off here for day one Dale Hollow event. We had an up and down practice, not sure what to expect. We've had a couple really warm nights, a lot of rain. Could have the fish moving around quite a bit. We're getting ready to take off, uh, sitting here still at the dock. We generally get, we get a half hour to get to our spot, but we're launching way up the river. You know, we're making a run down lake. I'm not, I'd rather get this out of the way now versus getting there and then uh, not being able to accomplish a couple of things I wanna get done before I can actually start fishing with lines in at 8 a.m. So uh, hopefully we got some fish catches for you before my next intermission update. Two and a half, three pounder. Fifteen. These grippers have got to go. They got to get some better. And the first period. I'm getting sick of these slow starts, guys. I really am. Uh, actually, it feels like the rain's going to be moving in here. I've got one fish sitting in 30 second place, just short of three pounds. I broke one off in a tree. Uh, that would have had us up around 20th place. I just found one on a bed with a couple of minutes to go before the period, so I'm hoping I can pluck him and then uh, fish around this area. This is one of the areas I had a good number of bites. We kind of just got in here. I broke the one off, caught the one and uh we're gonna see what we can do but we gotta get over these slow starts this is driving me nuts
good. Yeah, I'm good. Two six. No, if I catch another two six off that, we're not. We can't count it, right? All right. <laughs> Nice one. Somewhere around five six. Five six. Let's just see what it is. Get locked at five six. Five six. We'll take that for sure. Hey, let me take a picture of that. Yeah. They've been on it right about that. I don't think Let's get them back real quick. But. All right, period two has ended. We uh, had a better period. We caught four for, I don't know, uh, 14 pounds. We're currently sitting in 18th place. And, you know, we're really, I mean, we're, we're in a group of people. One fish puts us up several spots. One fish, you know, if we don't catch them, that drops us spots, but, uh, I think we've got the big fish overall too. We got a five stick, a five six, uh, so that's good. Hopefully that stands up through the last period. And uh, you know, I'd like to get over that 30 pound mark. So that means I need 13 pounds in this last period. I think it's doable. 
we need to get some bites. I mean, we uh, there's definitely more fish up shallow. Every fish I've caught so far has been a bed fish. Uh, I did just have like a what looked like a four pounder, a three and a half, four pounder, come up behind the floating worm and just track it and never ate it, which blows my mind. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna see what we can do. Hopefully we can catch a few more and push this up a few spots. love to move this stuff out of there. I just, part of me says it's actually helping us. Yeah. Two ten.
Just wrapped up day one. We are sitting in 20th place. That seems about par for the course. We uh, have 25-11. Had some opportunities at some other fish. I uh, hooked one, probably three and a half pounder on the outside of the mouth. Had three fish that were 114, 115s. Uh, missed a couple of other ones. I mean, I feel good about what we're doing. I think there'll probably be more fish coming still. You know, kind of really changed the game plan up, actually. We weren't really thinking about going bed fishing, but uh, we're kind of fish the moment, as they say. So we're going to head back to the ramp. We get a day to regroup, retie, and uh, get out of here with one more day uh, on Friday. Thanks for watching, everyone.